We are showing you the money on this Workforce Wednesday. And this week, we focus on our high schoolers, some of whom may soon be looking to jump right into a new career. From first mate to ship captain, there are plenty of opportunities through apprenticeships to accelerate their entry into the maritime industry after they graduate. Joining us on the couch, Carrie Ann Carty with Alaska Process Industry Careers Consortium and Brenda Picaro with Chalista Corporation to tell us how you can get started. Good, Good morning. morning. Good morning. Good morning. Carrie Ann, tell us about the apprenticeship program. What is it all about? Sure. Um, well, just like last week, we talked with Terry Federer about the training that's available at Avtech, and now we're going to talk about entry level uh, into an apprenticeship program, the school part of which is taught at the Avtech facility where they teach not just the nautical skills and being able to navigate in all kinds of water, but also you can get your uh, Coast Guard certifications, uh, learn the, sea, the shore side skills that will help you get to the on the job uh, training. And they've got, they've got this uh, state of the art simulator. Yes. Uh, to help people learn how to navigate in all kinds of conditions. It sounds like an amazing program. Um, Brenda, where does uh, Chalista fit in in all of this? Thank you, so we recognize the need for Alaskans as a whole to, to get them the kind of training that makes them employable. With great partnerships, we have created the Alaska Maritime Apprenticeship Program. And we're proud to report that we've just completed training for tier one for two apprentices. Okay. Very nice. And so once uh, these apprentices are trained, where will they work? Well, that's why we're here today, is to let industry know that we have several highly motivated candidates ready for work and the shortages within the industry. And so we're inviting the Alaska Maritime companies to join us in, in support of creating jobs for the Alaskans, that the jobs that they have available today. When we talk about those jobs, Carrie Ann, what, kind of, what kind of income can uh, these apprentices, once they finish up, what kind of uh, pay can they expect? Sure, and uh, there's a lot of different fields. So let's talk about deckhands in particular. Okay. They generally don't uh, receive an annual salary or an hourly wage, but they pay them on a daily rate starting at $250 an hour. They'll generally work on the sea about six months out of the year, and a first-year apprentice could expect to make about $60,000 a year. Um, you know, they're doing the training right here in Alaska and being able to do their on-ship time right here in Alaska, too. So we learn the pay for deckhands in particular, but getting back to the apprenticeship program, what career paths does it offer other than deckhands? Uh, with the, through the Chalista program, they're also offering uh, ship's galley training, so that would be uh, sh like chefs, but with specific skills that have to do with on the boat and how to do it in the galley situation. Um, and the other one is the QMED, and uh, I have to ask Brenda what that stands for, but that's uh, in the ship's engineering department. Okay. Uh, any special admission requirements? And or, you know, are there scholarships? So, you know, what kind of what kind of help is out there? Sure. Um, there there are some admission requirements. You have to have a high school diploma. You have to, like Terry, uh, Captain Federer, talked about last week, you have to be drug and alcohol free. That's one of the requirements. Um, <clears throat> the, uh, I'm sorry, the, the second part of your question, James, kind of escaped mm -hmm. me. Um, the, well, we talk about the scholarships. Oh, yeah, scholarships. There are, there is some funding available, and it's really on a case-by-case -case basis. So make sure that you do get the information and you talk with Brenda or someone at Chalissa to, to help you through that process. Some good opportunities out there, especially yeah. as graduation right around the corner. Um, if someone at home wants to learn more, how can they? Well, there's a great new website, the, apprenticeship, the Maritime, Alaska Maritime Apprenticeship uh, website has more information. Of course, the easy answer is just to go to the APEC website or call Martha and talk to us. All right. Ladies, thank you so much for your time on this Workforce Wednesday.